I, I was at I was at work yeah, when okay. uh, when they revealed the cards. It's, 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 it's like midnight. And you're so excited. No, no. So I knew, excited, I knew so, I knew something happened because I got like 20 notes. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And I glanced at my phone and like I see hey, so support da, da, da. So I was like, oh okay. Then then the, the top most notification is Mitch in my, my team chat saying, oh, these cars are ass. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Heal on Six back again with another quick video. Uh, today we're back with Vaughn the Senior. This guy is, has been always day one OTT Hexor main for New York City. And there was a, there was a reveal uh, earlier this week uh, of two, two beautiful Hexor cards for Hexor. Now, Christopher Allen, before we talk about those amazing cards, let's talk about Hexor. Now, you, you shown us how to run this deck, but I don't think people caught the memo. You want me to talk about Hexo, but I can't, I can't. We have to jump right into this. All right, these, these, these cards are bad. These cards are bad, and the problem is, I, when I said these cards are bad on Twitter, a lot of you, I don't know if I'm gonna frame them, but, but I, like, when I said these cards are bad on Twitter, a lot of you uh, acted like I didn't know what I was talking about. Like, no, no, it searches for the persona, da, da, da. Like, that's something Hexo really wanted. Like, that's gonna put Hexo back on the map, but not, not like, call these four. So the problem with the first hit, we we had this card before, remember? In, in second, it was, it was called Tosis, all right? It did the same thing. You searched for the persona, right, put it in your hand. And it was bad then, and I don't think we agreed it was bad then. But let, let's talk about, so so I wish I had the proxy print out. That's right. It's, it's up there. I don't know if you can see it on, on his camera on my raggedy, dusty phone. But listen, all right? You you counter blast one. It's on place grade one, 8K. That's nice. On place, counter blast one. You search the deck for, you know, a grade three hexo. All right, that's, that's what's for. So you say, oh, you can search for persona, da 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 da. But that, it, that action in and of itself undermines the whole ride line. It, it, it makes the ride line vanilla. Because think about it like this. So you have your, your grade one. Your, your, your Tia Square Sorceress. All right, if you write your Tia Square Sorceress, you inherently, all right, you, you want to counter blast one to draw the next turn. Right. All right, so you're counting on your opponent to give you that one damage. But now you have this grade one in your hand, because ideally you want to play it on turn two. That's the only quality window, by the way. We'll get back to that. So now you're looking at your opponent, begging them to give you two damage. Not only, so now, now you, first of all, you have to draw this card on time by turn two. Then you have to not have the persona in your hand, because you have the persona in your hand, you're not gonna search for another one, how long you think this game's gonna go on, all right? Then your opponent has to give you two damage. You see all these ifs to make this card viable, all right? And then if you don't, if you if you you don't get the two damage, let's say you only get one damage, now you gotta choose between your ride line and 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 this this kind of last one to search the deck. Oh my god, it's so bad. It's so bad. Like why why are you making uh, you shouldn't be running cards that have the potential to make your ride line a vanilla, all right? You shouldn't have to choose between your ride line and uh, a card that you put in the deck, all right? That's not consistency, all right? That's number one. So let's say let's say we move on. We're riding into two. All right, road to two. Uh, we we, we kind of last one to draw a card. There was this, uh, no, I have to go back now. There's a guy, all right, and I'm naming names. So my man, uh, Ast Astro Susano on Twitter or X or whatever you want to call this website this week, all right? Uh, he knows I love him, all the respect in the world for him. I respect his tops. He's friends with, uh, what's that dude in the beard? Solemn. All right, he's, he's a big dude over, over in Europe. All right, bro, he, my man told me, uh, just, just, just ignore the, the ride line skills in, in favor of searching for the, the, the great three. And that's mad, bro. That's mad. I gotta call you on that. That's wrong. That's wrong. And same thing when you, when you ride from two to three, all right, you're using Pentagleam skill. Pentagleam skill says I, you get to on riding to three. You look at the top three, we order those cards however you want, and put them back, all right? So now, why am I running a card that's going to shuffle the deck, all right, right after that? Why am I making my ride line of vanilla? You've, you've completely invalidated Pentagleam. This is why I don't want to cause that shuffle, by the way. You, you can't get in the way of your ride. Your ride line is the most consistent thing you have, because you're going to see it 100% of the time. So why are you running cards that get in the way of that? And now, not only are you doing that, you're, you're ruining your whatever potential triggers you had set up in favor of Persona Ride. But now, bro, look at Hexo, either Hexo. This one, Aquamarine, it doesn't matter, it's the same thing, all right? What happens, what does, what does Hexo do when you check no triggers? Nothing, she's a vanilla 13. Okay, so you're turning this deck into a vanilla, you're turning Hexo into vanilla, you, you've lost pressure, you've lost momentum. And now, when you Persona Ride, your opponent's gonna be at what, two damage? At best? You, uh, you haven't done anything all game. You're Persona Road and, and you're, you're, you're blind checking triggers, number one. 
All right. Number two, if you're not checking triggers, you're not generating shield. Now, if you're not generating shield, how are you even going to survive to turn four? All right. Divine skills are going to kill you. The first stride, Shirinui is going to kill you. Like, you, you can't, you can't do this, man. You can't. I'm trying to, I, I was trying to be, you know, professional and civil, but this, this is really getting me, it's, and it's not even bad at bad cards being printed. Bad cards get printed all the time. What upsets me, what disappoints me is, is the community reaction to it. Because I didn't, I haven't seen one person yet say that these cards were, don't work in Hexo. And I, and I know what the problem is. Y'all read these cards in a void. You didn't read the whole deck. You didn't read the ride line. You didn't read the, how the deck really supposed to function. You just read Search for Persona at its hand, all right? And maybe in another deck, that would be excellent. That would be immaculate, but not here. We can't do that here, all right? Uh, I, I believe that's it. I can't flame this card any anymore. But now you can flame. The cat, the cat's even worse. And I think I think we can walk on the cat, because I think we agree that this cat is bad. So uh, it says, on place, look at the top card of the deck and put it into the soul and back on top, all right? The first problem with that is, uh, we had this already, all right? We, we got we have, Wizard. We have, we have wizard. wizard. We have our Quadra cast. I'd rather use Pentagleam, honestly. I'm not even lying. This, yeah. this is better than Pentagleam. But like, there's, there's no need for it. Now, I have, um, what's, what's, what's my man's name on Twitter? Hikage oh, Fang. Girl, shout out to you, homie. homie uh, loves loves commenting on all my posts. All right, telling me this fixes Hexo's soul issues. Hexo did not have soul issues. All right, we have plenty of soul charters. All right, there, there's just no need for it. All right, if you're running low on soul, the only time I ever run on soul, low on soul, is if I hit all three cutie spirals right. on, on each ride. And at that point, I don't care if I run out of soul. I'm rich. I'm rich. Soul blast three, draw three. Excellent, immaculate. Um, and the second skill doesn't even make sense. It, it says, if I'm a Sorceress Vanguard, discard a card. Discard one. Discard a card. Reveal the top card. If that card is a Sorceress, you can add it to hand. But this, this, this isn't a Sorceress deck. Look at all the not Sorceress cards. You're, you're running Wizard. You're running, you could be running. Uh, both Cyclers. Both Cyclers, they're not Sorceress either. Which is uh, not, not negotiable. You gotta play both. Nah, people argue that. I can't, I can't convince them. You can't convince them to run better cards? You can't convince me not to run that. Um, Soldier so, boy, so, so soldier. Soldier is not a sorceress. Soldier. Uh, if replacement angel is not a sorceress, all right. The only sorceress in the deck are Octoray Delta and Hexo herself, yeah. and and the triggers, which I'm not gonna draw. Well, it's it's like, to come on, these y'all, these cards are bad. These cards, no, these, I mean, uh, and and <sighs> it's like, oh, it's frustrating. It's so frustrating because they're printing these cards and and. We as a community should be flaming them. Right. right. We should be delivering the message to be sure that we know these cards are bad. All right. The problem is y'all are glazing this card, especially the searcher. You're, you're glazing the searcher, and Bushiro is now convinced. They, they know Bushiro knows that you don't know what good cards look like, so they can keep printing bad cards, and you're gonna keep buying them. And that comes back to me. So now what? No, and I, somebody who knows how to play the deck right and build the deck right, wants good cards. I'm not gonna get them because they keep printing these cards for you. All right, and you're gonna come out. These cards are gonna come out. That's all these comments, English and Japanese. All right, talking about Hexo is back. They can't wait to run Hexo again to play the searcher to, to get your Persona ride. The Persona ride is not even the win condition. Checking triggers the win condition. You should be focused on that. All right, Persona ride is not a guaranteed win, especially now. The game's too fast. Where are my men? Yo, where are my men back here who think those cards are good? Speak up now. Oh, y'all are quiet. See, they got nothing to say. They got nothing. They got. They got nothing to say. All right, they had all. They had all. They were popping off earlier when I said, oh, you know, who thought these cards were good? Everybody had their hand raised. Everybody was popping off. Uh, now, what's up? Real quick, let's talk about our store owner in the back. Henry said. With a clean cut, Christopher Allen got a clean cut earlier. Yeah, he, he did me up. I was looking chopped up. Right? Yo, Henry, look at the camera real quick. There he goes. Let's go, Allen. We should be flaming this car. What's up? Yo. What's your final thoughts? On this, uh, let me tell you what I think Hexo means. All right, Hexo, I feel like is is very consistent in what she does. If you build her consistently, you stop putting cars like this in here. Uh, but her burst isn't as effective as it was anymore. I feel like Defensive Creep has really pushed along. Uh, it's, it's very hard to crack certain decks. We're at a point now where five attacks is, isn't is enough. All right, we got uh, Shirinui opening up seven attacks. We got Shoujo Doji. What, what do y'all open up, like nine? If you give us Karma. Whatever, they, they, they can open, they're opening up a lot of attacks. All right, five attacks on turn four is not enough. We gotta do better. So I would like a card 
and Hexel really needs a card to speed up the Persona ride. So I would like a not not like Ava where you search the deck, ride it, because again, you can't search because you can't shuffle, it's it's gonna ruin things. A card that force activates persona, like like a Hexel yeah. chalice. You know what I mean? Um, nice. and you know, if, if your opponent's not on grade three, let's say you don't get the 10k, but at least declares Persona Ride is active so that, you know, certain effects can start going off. Because, uh, G3, original Exorb uses, uh, Persona Ride on second skill. Yeah, if you want to use that. And then, and then, Walk Me needs Persona Ride. Yeah, but if you made a card like that, I wouldn't even use, uh, base, uh, the original Exorb, I'd go straight out. you go straight out. straight out. But, uh, that, that's something Hexorb needs. Oh, yeah. And then give it a second skill to help it scribe. Yeah. See, uh, go, go, going back to what I said before, no, you have to turn it off. Bring her up here, all right? These cards, both Hexorbs, I got her right away. See, she's loyal. Uh, both no, Hexorbs, they do nothing if you don't check triggers. So you have to commit the entire deck, all right, to checking triggers for the sake of consistency. If you don't check triggers, there's no deck. If you don't check triggers, you don't have any shield. You have no, you have no defense, you have no offense. You are, you're an empty seat, all right? You're honestly an empty seat now, the meta is so tough. So I actually took out Wizard. I know y'all are screaming already that I took out a Pokemon. But we took out Wizard. We put in uh, the two extra copies of Delta. So now we're running uh, four, uh, excuse me, four Octoray, four Delta. So eight, eight Octorays, essentially. And two slots left over. I was like, we need great ones. You've got to boost the Hex off. Unboost the Hex off is a sad Hex off. So I put in two copies of Dark Glass. I don't like her, but until set three comes out and that new, uh, there's a new grade one looking uh, sorceress lady. I forgot her name, but she draws a card and she gets power. She's nice. I'm running her. Later. But right now, we're running two Dark Glass. Other than that, the deck has not changed. You gotta run eight cyclists. The cyclists synergize too well with Hexo's Rod Line, uh, Oct Rays. Uh, we're running Soldier. You gotta run Soldier. Soldier, the, the, the Soldier of Revolution hasn't started yet. They don't, it's not going to start. People, people don't believe that card is good. And, and when I say, every time I say people roll their eyes, it doesn't make any sense. All right, you, you need to have some sort of early game. There are. How many zones? There are six zones. There are right. six zones. Six zones. You, you have to get as many attacks as possible, as early as possible. These decks are better than that. You can't play turn four against a stride deck, against uh, half these faded decks, right? They're better than you. All right? You can't play on their terms. You have to play earlier than that. You have to be better than that. You have to be faster. That's, that's what worries me about, um, what's that, that the Brant Gate deck that just got revealed this morning? The, the one with the, the ball? The, the, in Paul, though? In Paul, the, with the, with the built-in damage checks? I, whatever. Yeah, bro, if it's built-in damage checks, I'm like, you can't even rush him down. Oh, I'm screaming. <laughs> oh, I'm screaming that that's gonna destroy me. But, uh, other than that, I think I have said my piece on these cards. If you disagree with me, all right? I don't know if, if Ray's gonna put like the cards up there or my, my put my Twitter tag up there. So, so if, if you have beef with something I said, if you really want to debate about it, and I do, I want to talk about these cards. Hit me up on x, x.com, twitter.com, whatever you lost doing today. Uh, I'd love to talk to talk about these cards some more. Uh, if you agree, if you disagree, whatever. All right. I'd love to talk about Hexo. You know, it's very hard to find Hexo play. They're gone. They're gone. They're gone. They're gone. Um, Ray, Ray, you got, uh, Ray, raise the goal. I uh, appreciate you. I try not to. Again. I try not to. All right, he's, he's going to be doing this thing with Shoto Doji later. I'm sure you're going to see him all the time. Uh, I, I'll try. I'll try. I'll try to do my best, but I'll try to see you back on camera again. It's hard, but this man is tough. Like, I mean, I'm not doing terribly, so that that part shocks me. But I'm I'm going like fifth place, sixth place. I think today I was sixth place. Like I'm I'm bubbling out constantly, but I'm trying. You know. You know, this city's got a lot of killers. It's New York City, of course. You know, you can't get any better Vanguard than uh, over here, NYC. It's rough, it's rough out here. That, say, that being said, that being said, uh, I am trying to travel around. I yes. know uh, I got a few friends in down south that want to see me in Georgia. I, I'm trying to pull to Georgia. Uh, I don't know about the other ones, but... We'll see. I'll try, I'm trying we're, to get uh, We're all gonna have to try, because New, New York doesn't even have a fucking Location. I for mean, come BCS. Philly's, Philly's not far. It's Philly's like, not far, it's but like, like it's definitely not no New, New Jersey. Listen, all right, you're, now you're just being lazy, and, and he's proving my other point. All right, it's really hard to get some of these New Yorkers to travel. Now, I'm trying to get a, a team, a nice caravan out there. We can go to hit the Cali spot down south. Texas, I like to go to Texas. I know a few people out there, and they're like, no, these guys barely want to go to Jersey. Forget Texas, you know. So. We'll see. We'll see. I, 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 li I like the meta, despite everything I said. All right, and my cards being garbage. Uh, I like the meta. I like the the way the packs are being set up. I love divine skills. I was hoping I was hoping to get one on my own, but no. Yeah, but, uh, 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 and you know, it's, it's great. It's great. I say that now, but they're gonna reveal Night Rose. It's gonna make us cry. We'll see. Right, we'll, right see we'll, we'll see. We'll see by next year. Uh, World's ain't till um, April anyway. So. so, bottom line, listen. These cards look good. They don't work. They don't really work. And you could say something like, oh, well, 
if, if it negates the rod line, run a different rod line. You can't run a different rod line because it needs a Sorceress Vanguard. So you take the Sorceress Vanguard out, you can't even play it on turn two. You know what I mean? It's just, oh my god, this cat. So the cat the cat has to reveal a Sorceress at the top of the deck, but the cat itself is not a Sorceress. Ah! It, it, it bricks if it sees itself. I didn't, I didn't need that. So it's like, what are you going to do? Bro, this ah! These cards, these cards are bad, and it looks like they tried to make them bad. They're not even like accidents. It, it really looks like laser precision, unplayable cards. So I know, I think I know a little bit about Hexon. If I maybe, or maybe I'm dumb. Maybe I'm dumb. Some people I know are fangirls. Yeah. Well, we'll, we'll see. Come set four. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, Vaughn this year. Thank you for having us. Thank you, maybe for coming back on. Thank you. And uh, what channel are we on? What are we, what are we calling the HO6? Just HO6? Or do I well, we'll call HO6, you can say HO6. It's HO6, I know. But it's either or at this point. You were trying to rebrand though. It's whatever. It's right, a, it's, well, I'm HO6. Let's get it. This is the last stop on this train. Everyone, please leave the train. Thank you for riding with MTA New York City Transit.